Hey, hi all. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how you can uninstall Eclipse IDE from Windows 10 machine. If you are looking out for this solution, then it is very much useful for you. So let us begin. So as you can see, the Eclipse is already installed on my uh, system. There is an icon here. You can see it's on my desktop. And this is the application, the Eclipse uh, IDE that is on my system. Okay, let me show you the Eclipse version I'm using. So you can see the Eclipse version is this one. Uh, so I'm going to uninstall this Eclipse uh, from my uh, Windows system uh, because sometimes we need to uninstall the Eclipse, the existing Eclipse version so that we can upgrade to the, the latest one. We will try step by step and see whether we can uninstall the Eclipse by those process or not. First, we'll try to uninstall the Eclipse from the control panel and let us see whether we can do that or not. Let me open the control panel. So as you can see, this is my control panel. Let me try if I can find the Eclipse version or not. I'm not able to find, right? I'm not able to find the Eclipse the file to uninstall. It's not available. See, this is not available. So I cannot uninstall from control panel. Then what is the next process? What is the other solution I may look at? Okay, let me try it another way. So let me try to uninstall from the Eclipse application itself. Can I do that or not? Is there any option here? I'm not able to find any option, right? I'm not able to find any option to uninstall the Eclipse from my system. So it is very frustrating, right? It's very frustrating not to find the option to uninstall the Eclipse either from the control panel or from my Eclipse application itself. So basically, I'm not able to find those options to uninstall the Eclipse. What is the solution I'm going to show you now? So let me show you some important points before uninstalling. The reasons are these are because Eclipse cannot be uninstalled from the Windows control panel and Eclipse does not have any uninstaller to support the uninstallation process. Okay, so these are the main reasons why you, you cannot uninstall the Eclipse from the system directly. It cannot be uninstalled uh, the way you uninstall the other exe files, other Windows applications. Then how to uninstall that? You need to delete all its installation files from its install directory. So what I'm trying to say that whenever you install this Eclipse, it always stores some files. It get installed in a location in a, in a file directory where you can see all the files. So those files we have to delete manually in order to remove the Eclipse completely from the system. So let us see how we can do that. So as you can see, this is my uh, file directory. This is my location. C users. Users need to go to your C drive. Then you go to the users folder. Then you go to the username of your uh, the system. Then you can see uh, there are a lot of files available. There is dot eclipse. Then I have dot p2. Then eclipse folder. So whenever you install eclipse, all these three folders get created. Let us see what is inside. As you can see, this is the eclipse installation folder. These are all the files. We need to delete all these files to remove or uninstall Eclipse from the system. Along with that, we also need to delete .eclipse and .p2 file. So as you can see, there are Eclipse file as well inside .p2 folder. And similarly, we have under .eclipse folder as well. Let me delete all the three folders. I will do shift delete. So before that, let me close this Eclipse and I will uh, delete all of them now. I'm deleting all the three files prominently. So all my three uh, files, Eclipse uh, files are deleted from the directory. Apart from that, you also need to delete the Eclipse icon from the desktop. So let me delete this icon also. So the icon is deleted. Once all these files are deleted, you need to restart your system. So let me restart the system. My system has just restarted. Now let me show you if I can find Eclipse or not. Let me find Eclipse. Eclipse is not there. So Eclipse successfully got uninstalled. I deleted all the important files from the Eclipse installation directory. Hence Eclipse got uninstalled. So this is how we can uninstall the Eclipse uh, from the Windows system. So that's all about how we can achieve an uninstallation of Eclipse from the Windows system. If you have liked the video, please hit the like button and please subscribe to my channel. I'll be creating more and more important videos. Thank you. Thanks for watching.